Hey guys, how are you doing? I am Pratesh, and if you are on Sales Handy's agency portal, so you might be an agency owner or someone who is looking to use multiple accounts with Sales Handy. So, agency portal lets you manage all your clients under one roof. It means you don't have to worry about creating individual accounts for your clients and to save login details individually. You can scale it so easily, and it makes your outreach effective and your productivity reaches the next level. So, let's just see how does it work. So. To log in, you have to come on the URL called agency.saleshandy.com, and you have to fill your login details like this, and just log in. We are now logged in, and you can see here are two tabs. The first tab is the clients, so you can see here are all my clients or all the sales and accounts that I have created with the portal. The next tab is the team. The team are the members who manages all the sales and accounts or the client members. So first of all, let's talk about the clients. So client is a sales handy account that you just create from portal. So let me just add a new client for example and we can just give it a name like PR agency right. And when you create a client it helps you enable or it helps you log in with just one single click. You just have to click it over here and it would land you in a fresh brand new sales handy account. This is the fresh sales handy account that portal creates for you whenever you add a new client. So if you want your client to access a sequence and check the progress, you can just share the view only mode feature and the client can only see what's happening around and he can't edit it. So you can just do it via going into the settings, then the team. Now to add your client as a member, just click it over here and enter the name of the client and share the email ID. Remember the credentials and the password of this account will be shared to the one who has created or added this member, right? So just submit it and the email would be sent to your email ID or the someone who has created or added this member. So now we have seen how view only mode works. So let's just jump on agency portal again. You can also enable or disable a client just by toggling it off or toggling it on. You can also delete a particular client from sales and portal very easily. Now we have discussed how clients work. So let's just now see what are the team and how you can manage it. So just switch it over here. And these are all the team members that I've added who manages my clients or the sales and accounts that are created with Sales Handy's agency portal. So if you want to add a member or invite a member, just click on invite member and write a name and enter the email ID. The login credentials will be sent on the email ID when the user accepts invitation. Now we have learned that how to invite the team members. So let's just learn how to assign them roles for the particular clients. So for example, if you want this particular team member to handle a certain client, so click on the assign clients icon. And from here, we can enable the access or disable the access for a particular client to this team member. For example, we just now created a sales send account for a PR agency. So for this particular team member, we can just enable the permission over here. Right? Now we can assign him two roles. The first one is a team leader and the second is a user. Whenever you assign team leaders role to your member, so they have access to the client's account, they can edit it, they can change the permissions. Also, they can add the new users in the particular account. Now, when you add someone as a user, so they only have an access to the client, they can edit it, but they can't change the permission and they can't add a new user in the particular account. So this way you can manage your permissions so right now just me give let me just give a team leaders permission and save it so this was all about handling the clients and handling the team if you have any billing related queries just reach out to support and they will help you out or you can just get in touch with them with this chat box over here you can ask them questions if you are facing any technical difficulty or you have any other questions they would be much happy to help you out thank you and have a nice day